Hello guys, how are you? So today is a pretty special day since uh, my personal newsletter which is called Instep, uh, it has been launched. So this newsletter is all about uh, bringing latest tools that are under the radar. So uh, in a sense, it is different from other newsletters like Inside Dev, Inside AI, uh, TechCrunch, etc. Uh, they basically focus on uh, latest tools that are very prominent that are at the top so basically the purpose of this newsletter uh, is to connect under the radar tools and the creators of those, those tools with the investors developers and end users so uh, the the gap between them uh, shrinks and they are able to uh, connect with their right audience so uh, let's get started and see uh, what do we have in this newsletter. So the first on the list is Flux.1. It is basically a family of uh, models uh, and they are text to image generation models. So they are open source and uh, they are basically the state of the art text to image model. And it is, uh, and these models are brought to you by uh, Black Forest Labs. This, this is the company behind them and, and they are uh, recently founded and uh, they have uh, basically, uh, they were uh, being funded and they recently uh, secure a funding. So hats off to them that they recently uh, got the uh, investment and uh, they have uh, already uh, made these models. So uh, they have partnered with, with Replicate and uh, Fail.ai. So you can uh, go, go there and you can use uh, these offerings, these models on these platforms. So uh, let's see uh, what, what's on the uh, on the second number. So the second number is basically a Turbit or whatever you call, you can call it. So it is basically a Node.js based tools and you can build applications, scripts and automations. Uh, and it is basically uh, resource intensive operations to perform uh, resource intensive operations using Node.js. Um, it is a multi-core computing uh, tool for Node.js and it is ideal for data processing, data processing and analysis, scientific computations, batch processing and complex algorithmic operations. So the third on the, on the list is this distill kit. It is basically for LLM distillation. So uh, large language models, uh, you know, we have multiple large, large um, uh, language models and this tool is for them and it is open source and it is a toolkit uh, provided by rkey.ai and they provide easy to use tools for researching exploring and enhancing the adoption of open source large language models so uh, it is a pretty a pretty good tool and i think uh, these kind of tools are necessary are necessary for the time being so yeah. lms are recently uh, being launched and uh, there are so many open source uh, lang language models so it is best to uh, work on these kinds of tools and uh, let's uh, go towards the third third one so the fourth one so it is basically a school archive or whatever you say uh, school for the scholars it is an open source and minimal application that allows users to search read bookmark share download and view summaries for, of academic papers from archive repositories so it basically uh, uh, shed us, uh, sheds a spotlight on uh, on the academic papers and it is free and open, open source please do check it out so the next one is Lumina and GPT so it is basically a multi-model uh, multi-model models uh, and they are capable of uh, vision and language tasks multiple so and they excel in generating flexible and photorealistic images uh, from text descriptions the next on the list is uh, the Llama 2 accessory. So it is basically an open source toolkit for the pre-training, -tra pre fine-tuning and deployment of LLMs and multimodal LLMs, meaning MLLMs. So uh, I think uh, that's a good tool. Uh, please do check it out. Next one on the list is related to crypto and uh, anti-money laundering things. So if you want to check out uh, that if uh, the cryptocurrency transactions are in compliance, uh, are in compliance with the anti anti money 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 laundering uh, regulations uh, you should uh, definitely check it out uh, sorry for the 
So it, it basically checks cryptocurrency transactions for compliance with anti-money laundering regulations. It analyzes transactions data and can calculates the risk percentages to prevent criminal uh, frauds. So the next one on the list is super memory. It is a relative, relatively uh, older tool. Uh, I think it was launched uh, some months ago, six to seven or nine months ago. Uh, but uh, it is uh, like a notion where you, where you can say that it is a second brain and you, you can uh, place your ideas there. But it is for your bookmarks. So it is AI powered and it's like a chat GPT for your bookmarks. Uh, it is used for organizing, searching, and utilizing saved information uh, with tools like search engine, uh, writing assistant, and canvas. Uh, its key features are basically the import. It, you can import, organize, and resurface bookmarks whenever you need them. And you can find any saved information quickly. And you can interact with any uh, uh, knowledge base. And uh, it is open source. Last but not least, it is open source and easy to deploy locally. Word. That's a good word. The next on the list is uh, Open Search GPT, and it is basically uh, Perplexity and Search GPT is clone, but it is for you. It's like a personalized AI search engine. Uh, it learns uh, from you and your interests uh, whenever you browse them, and then uh, according to that data, uh, it will uh, help you out uh, in bringing uh, the search results that are uh, closer to you. Uh, please uh, do check it out and give them a thumbs up so high impact it is basically a 2d search search engine and uh, game engine sorry uh, and it, it it basically compiles to windows mac linux and version for for the web uh, i have checked check their uh, blog out and i for the better overview uh, i would recommend to go uh, and read their blog uh, to get the full picture so the next uh, is I think it's the last one. It is uh, Lilama Voice. It's basically a work in progress. Uh, their document documentation uh, isn't complete. Uh, they need your help uh, contributing uh, for the comp contribution. Uh, uh, I, I would strongly recommend that you go, go out, check their repository, and uh, contribute uh, to whatever your uh, expertise are. So it is basically a Lilama-based model uh, for large-scale voice, uh, voice generation, right? Llama based model for a large scale voice generation. It predicts continuous features directly, streamlining the process compared to traditional models using vector quantiz quantiz quantization for speech code prediction. I think it will it will be a huge hit once uh, they have uh, enough contributors. I believe uh, they will go big. Uh, it's time to uh, hop on uh, to, to this tool. And uh, I, I strongly believe that it will be a huge hit. They do need your help, so please uh, do check check them out and uh, give them a thumbs up. And basically, th this is our, our mission that uh, uh, we want to deliver the latest tools that are that that are hidden and they are potentially game changing in the tech industry. And we want to connect investors, founders, entrepreneurs, developers, and end users with these uh, early stage uh, founders and early stage tools so this is our mission statement basically so guys this is the uh, this is uh, this is the wrap on the first edition of uh, instec newsletter if you want to go to uh, the source where you want to read re read all all of, all of the information and uh, check these uh, tools out from their original source uh, please go to my linkedin profile uh, subscribe to my uh, newsletter and read the first edition of this newsletter uh, I think it will be a huge uh, help for me and uh, for these emerging uh, innovators. So guys, uh, thank you very much. If you are interested in partnering, partnering with us, uh, uh, you can uh, uh, schedule a one-on-one -on -one or uh, you can uh, email me directly at walihan76 at the of gmail.com. So guys, thank you very much. Stay tuned and we will uh, soon see each other in the next uh, edition of Instech Newsletter. Thank you very much. Bye.